Tisha, no Auntie Lola. But I got a lead on a lab your dad was using. I'll keep you in the loop. Got it. Me and Ava are in the Rangate Security Center. There's definitely data moving in and out. Go Team Mushroom. <laughs> yeah, go us. The data's gotta be connected to the lab. I'll call when I find it. This is it. Tisha, I'm at the RAND gate too. Can you open loading base 7 from the control center? Sure can. So the lab's in the building. I'm on my way. Cool. See you in. Messing around. See what you're hiding, Reed. One secret lab. So what's it for? Another blood drive. Just like on the pier.
that took my blood at the CDC HQ. The code for this blood drive is catabasis. K-A-T-A-B-A-S-I-S. No, I'm fried, Rick. Enjoy! Am I next? So, let's see what they were gonna do to me. What? Science. Oh, I'm wasting my fucking time. The only way to get answers is from Dr. Ruben Rio. Okay. Hey there, Noah. Sorry about all this, buddy. Could have been me in there. Well, uh, look, I'd love to stay and chat and everything, but I... Uh, oh! Oh, okay. oh, great! I had to wake sleeping! Fucking beauty! Oh, shit. All this shit stop. Kind of freaky, huh? You hit rock bottom and you bounced hard. You're gonna feel that one for a while. Living for the drama, I see. Lola, we got others to cover. I know. I know. But rebirth is never easy. <laughs> We all needed help through this one. We are rare. Precious. What's... What's happening to me? What am I? We are. Well... Reuben calls us Newman. We are the endpoint. Humanity 
distilled. I'm sorry. I had to push you hard. There is some cataclysm level shit coming down the line. It won't wait. And it's not kind. Only Newman, like us, can carry humanity through it. What, the, the, the plague? No, Ruben's trying to stop it somehow, okay? You're gonna have to ask him- There is no plague. Ruben, he was a good man once, but now he is blinded by desperation. He's not making a cure. But what? He's not making a cure because he can't. No one can. Humans. The autophage. Newman. It's an immense life cycle. A survival mechanism spanning countless eons. And you, we, are the Omega Point. No. No, none of this makes any fucking sense. You're... you're nuts! Well, you are in deep denial. And you've had my two cents, so go and ask Reuben his. But whatever conclusion you come to, remember... What the fuck? How was she in my head? Oh, what has Ruben gotten me into? I gotta find him. Reed! Reed, you copy? Answer me, dammit!
took off from the Surly. Tisha just flew out of here. I saw. He say anything? Not a damn thing. Jimmy's trying to figure it out. Oh, that genius. I need to check Ruben's office. Find anything? Fucking piece hey, of shit. Whoa. Hey, I know what you did. Hey, calm the fuck down. It's all in there. Ruben, a Shacklin, whatever the fuck that is, and your name. Over and over. You all started the outbreak. No. You fucking psycho! Well, I didn't know. He said my blood was the cure. I thought I was helping. I thought he would get me back to my brother. He killed my city. I should have put a bullet in him. Hey, no! Uh, but that had information. No, we could have found out where he's gone. I know where he's gone. He's flown to some lab on Hollywood Boulevard. Jimmy! What? Everyone's freaking out. We need you out here. All right. In a minute. What should I tell him? That you're Jimmy fucking Montana and you'll lead them through this. You can figure out how later. Yeah. Yeah. June Montana. Nine seasons on the badge. Nine fucking seasons! Hey! Shut your holes, you bitches! Jimmy Montana's in charge now! You know what? That is fucking it. I am through with all this fucked up shit! <laughs> Emma Jaunt! Emma! It's Ryan. You copy? Hello? Hello? Did your doctor get you out? Oh, did he? Fuck. I got a new plan. A helicopter, parked on Hollywood Boulevard. I, uh, know a pilot. He's a big, big fan of yours. I just... Well, I... I need you to persuade him to fly. Persuade him to... Hey, if you think I'm gonna fuck some creep so you can fly out of here... What? <laughs> hey, no, look. We're all getting out. I just... I need you to talk to him. He's... Lived in the sewers for like 20 years, and he's agrophobic. Oh, that's splendid. We'd have more chance on a magic carpet. You know the world thinks you're dead, right? I bet they're already recasting your movie. Bet they are, the wankers. Okay, I'll meet him. But no promises. Right. He, uh, lives in the sewer outfall. Okay, I'm, uh, on my way. Can't wait.
People are starving! Go out and get some then. Sweet Patton, this time I am getting out. So you have a death Hello? wish, hmm? Life is to be cherished, not thrown away like spoiled meat. Uncovering the root of these tremors could take us so much closer to understanding the virus. Does that not spark any curiosity in that dull skull of yours? I'm sure it does. I'm curious about many things. Like how on God's earth we came to be related. Now there's a sight for sore eyes. Hey, Curtis. How you finding your new home? Company's a marked improvement here. That's for damn sure. Just a pity that the tasteful Miss John left the stocking of the liquor cabinet to her tasteless hound of a husband. <laughs> you know, I'm out there fighting zombies and wading through sewage and God knows what. I think you can cope with cheap drink. Why settle for less, I say? These good people welcome me into their home. They deserve the best. <laughs> and I happen to know that slacker up the hill was holding on to some vintage art killing whiskey as an investment. And when those internet kids moved in, I gave them a bottle of Maison Saint-Vivant that's older than they are. <laughs> if only some kind soul would help an old man out. I could raise everyone's spirits. Oh yeah, sure. Let me get right on that. As soon as I've saved the world. Ha ha ha! Get me those drinks, and I swear to you, I'll make it worth your time. I've got something special that'll make those mealy-mouthed, undead bastards slither back into their graves. <laughs> For real? All right, you twisted my arm. I'll get the booze. 
I knew I could rely on you, kid. Godspeed. Find this vintage whiskey and get out. Okay, Constant. Procession of the Equinoxes. First identified by the Greek astronomer Hipparchus in 129 BC. A cyclic wobbling in orientation of Earth's axis of rotation with a period of 25,772 years. <laughs> Constant. Hey, Constant. Plenty of empties. No sign of it here. on him with this. Not the one I want, luckily. Curtis is brand.
unlocked. This guy must have been a real booze fiend. The girlfriend had the key. Hey, this is the stuff. I am almost tempted to keep it. Okay. 
Okay. Even I know you keep wine in a wine cellar.
looks cheap. Oh, this ain't it. Looks cheap. This one just feels expensive. It must be right. You there, kid? If you're still down at that modern mansion, look out for a cigar box. The finest Cubans. Gave them as a housewarming gift. And I got a hankering. Hey, we had a deal here. <laughs> then I'll sweeten the deal. Check their master bedroom, and you'll find a little something extra. Whiskey, wine, and cigars. How is he still alive? That's everything. Better get back before you order the cheese board. That is an early Christmas present for me. If I can find this mailman.
Booze and smokes, as you ordered. You're too good to me, kid. And don't let anyone say that Curtis Sinclair is not a man of his word. You take my rifle, Peggy. And for the cigars, I'll throw in some ammunition to get you started. Ah, oh, cool. That's a nice looking gun. Old Peggy's done right by me over the years, but my joints can't handle her kickback no more. Treat her right, and she'll look after you, too. Appreciate it, but, uh, what if zombies get into the house? Ah, uh, no need to worry about me, kid. They can try and bite me. My hide's tougher than a two-dollar steak. Besides, I can still handle a pistol just fine. I'll be all right with Peggy's little sister, Betty, on my hip. <laughs> Down in the sewers, risking your life for a bunch of numbers, huh? She knew what she was getting into when she married me. Andrea. Welcome. Good to see you alive. Not cleaning? No. I burnt my mop. It was that to shove it up a certain gulo. Ooh. Things got a little tense here, huh? I must confess. I raised my hand to Emma and Sam. Not something they'll forget in a hurry. I'll bet. Ah, Emma was such a lovely girl once. Fame has not been kind to her, but perhaps something good can come from all this horror. Would be a first. Yes, maybe. I just think perhaps with Sam she can start again. Emma turning nice? That would take a miracle. Miracles happen. She came to this house, you know. Wow. We will be safe now. For a moment, I saw the old Emma. So where are they? Ah, you only just miss them. After my chancla... <laughs> well, they seem keen to leave. They're waiting for you at the sewers. Emma Jones, in the sewers. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> not sure she knows what she's in for. Well, may God watch over you all. And whatever happens, you will always be welcome at the Salazar residence. Thanks, Andrea.
<laughs> what was that? Did I smirk? You made a breakthrough? Nah, just thinking. Back to the sewers. Die any moment. People do things you wouldn't. What? You think mom's not... got it? Emma? Sam? This is Ryan. Are you there? Hello? Sam. I'm sure they're fine. Oh, you're here. Yeah. Stop by your place, but Andrea said you'd gone ahead. <laughs> yes, well, she really wanted us to stay, but... We are, have to be firm with her. <laughs> hey, right. who's out there? Oh, it's me, buddy. I brought friends. Be nice. <laughs> oh, hey. Oh! oh. Hello? Oh, it's a mess. Everywhere! Miss Jones. Oh, there's no need to kneel. Oh. We're not the Queen. Uh, Call me Emma. Tap on. Ah! Uh, Patton. And I'm Sam B. You know, who do you voodoo, bitch? Patton, I really need your help. There's a helicopter on Hollywood Boulevard. We need you to... Oh, no, 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 I, I, I can't. You know Omen to Kill? Yeah? Remember how Randy couldn't get back in a car after his crash? Uh. But then, 
When the monster was about to get me, he suddenly shows up in a Camaro and saves me. So cool. I need you to be my Randy. Be Randy for all of us. Okay. Okay, yeah. I'll try. Oh. For you. <sighs> Thank you. I think I remember how to fly. We're going to die in a fireball. Come on, let's go. This way for the happy ending. Thank you, kind sir. Oh. Honestly, doesn't matter. Hey, don't worry. It's time for a new chapter. It's gonna be good. Hollywood, everyone wants to use you. Or if they don't, they burn up like... Yes! Thought it was a red one. After. <coughs> Me. Fine. Pressure to get past. Man, the other guy's got the easy job. 